Hey there, this is Death Star Killer, and welcome to The Matrix Awakens, an Unreal Engine 5 experience. Now, this isn't a game as far as I know. It's not even a demo for a game. It's a demo for the Unreal Engine 5 and what it can do today. This is supposed to be the closest they've gotten so far to getting rid of that uncanny valley look that people have. By the way, I've checked and there are no spoilers in this for anybody worried about it spoiling the movie when it comes out next week. Let's see how unreal it is. <laughs> okay, let's do it. <laughs> Classic. That's impressive. Hi, I'm Thomas Anderson. Like many of you, I work with computers. I like the freedom I feel outside the limitations of the real world. But computers are also mirrors, reflecting back who and what we are and the choices we make, the worlds we build. They also confront us with questions. That's live action. About why we want to choose this over that. Why we want to make X instead of Y. Where do ideas of who we are and what we want even come from? You can tell from the movement, I think. Take the red pill. That that was and I show you how to live the action. Go. This isn't real. What is real? How do you define real? For instance, I'm not even sure why I'm here. Okay, now he's graphics. I remember waking up and thinking that I'm supposed to come here. That it was important for me to ask people, how do we know what is real? It's still very good. Hi, I'm Keanu Reeves. Over 20 years ago, I first played the character Thomas Anderson in the Matrix trilogy. Those films pioneered digital cinema with shots like bullet time. Back then, we talked a lot about where the digital age might take cinema and narrative. In an industry where actors have tried to remain perpetually young, we wondered <laughs> about digital faces that could become immortal. Hi, I'm Carrie Ann Moss, and I played Trinity in the Matrix films. 20 years ago, we asked ourselves how long it would be before faces and bodies could be changed as easily as we change clothes. We wondered, what would identity mean in a completely digital world? And what that would reality great. mean? It's it when is the movement, though, that gives it away, but only very own. slightly. It's getting better and better. Oh, cool. Whoa. What just happened? Whoa. Yeah, this is what they wanted. They said they were fine with your theoretical mumbo-jumbo, but they needed some sexy action. <laughs> The marketing people. Marketing? <laughs> I thought we were supposed to have total creative control. Welcome to the Matrix. <laughs> you still got it. Like riding a bike, they say. I sometimes miss this version of us. Me too. <clears throat> the hell are you doing back there? Sorry, I was told this is a sim preparing me to fight the system. Right on. You know about this? Yeah. It's all supposed to be a little unreal. Word of advice. Agents are bad, but whatever you do, stay the hell away from marketing. <laughs> See you soon. Oh, now that's good looking. So? It's all good looking. <laughs> Haven't you ever watched a movie before? Shoot the tires. Say no more. Keep them off us. You drive. Oh, okay. Come on. Oh, wow. <laughs> That looks so good. Oh. 
Go oh, gotcha, you bastard. Oh shit. Oh. Oh shit. Oh. Boom, motherfucker. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this looks so good. Shit. Graphics, this is just Cyborg. wow. <laughs> of course, they have a helicopter. Of course, they've got a helicopter. Yes. We need cover. Hang on. <laughs> We've come a long way from Hong. <laughs> Bye bye, yes, you thief bastard. Ah! Jesus. It's not a mini gun, but it's still cool. Come, and get it. Come on, motherfucker! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Jeez! Oh my god! Now let's get that fucking helicopter. Come on! Hold steady. Yeah, baby! Hell yeah! What are you doing? Time to blow this box down. Wow. God, imagine Grand Theft Auto like this. Or anything like this. Now what? Oh, wow. Mass AI, crowd and traffic system. I don't know what that means. Does that mean every one of them is their own little thing? Uh, I don't know. Toggle day and night. Oh, cool. This is more for you tech nerds out there, I'm sure. <laughs> You'll understand. How brilliant all this is to me, it just looks good. What is this? Nanite visualization. It's like Tron or something. Weird. Toggle displayed rendered pixels. That just made the background go a bit fuzzy. I don't know. <laughs> I'm like Predator 2. I'm in town with a few days to kill. Again, it just makes the background go a bit, I know, interlaced or de interlaced or something. Okay, there's no more toggling. Oh, cool, I get to run around a bit. Wow. Can I 
drive a car. <gasps> I can drive a car. Oh, wow. Okay. Let's fly the drone for a bit. Whoa. Let's go up and look at this building up here closer. Oh yeah, look at the lighting. That's very impressive. Oh yeah, no. <laughs> well, I suppose I, it's safe to say this is the first truly next-gen thing I've seen. This is amazing. Alright, let's drive a car. Oh, where have I put myself? In the middle of nothing. <laughs> Let's go get a car. Can I steal a car from the street? Let's, let's get a cop car. Nope. Ah, bollocks. Okay, any of these? They're all boring. Any muscle cars? No muscle cars anywhere? Bueller. There's a Porsche. Oh, there's a Porsche. Let's, let's do it. Check the controls. <sighs> Accelerate, stop, handbrake. That's all I need. Okay. Oh, that's strange. They seem to have forgotten to put the sound of the engine in. Uh, you can't expect everything. This is very impressive. So, not a big deal if they. Ooh! Whoopsie. <laughs> God, the controls are actually a little bit too realistic for me. You can't just do your crazy handbrake stuff like you can in Grand Theft Auto. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> I want to see if I can do an impressive crash. Because this looks... Oh, look! Wow, I derezzed it or matrixed it or something. Is that gonna happen to any car I hit? It is. Or maybe not. What if I hit people? Ooh, oh yeah, derezzed. Whoa, bollocks. Ah, shit. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. Is there anything I can do a stunt off? A jump. Wow, this is 90 miles an hour and it feels really fast! Whoa! Look what I found! Looks like I should be able to do a jump off that. Okay, let's find one of the fast cars. Although, something about doing it in a classic... I don't know what kind of car they are, but you know they're in, the, they're in every car chase there is pretty much. Not the fastest car in the world though, but maybe I can get it. Well, it goes past 88. Right, let's do it now. <laughs> will, will I find a window in the traffic to even get near this jump? We'll try. Oh no, there's a car just in front of it. Can I get past it? Probably not! Not a hope. God damn. I try again.
Well, I guess that's a little realistic. <laughs> in the movies, there's never traffic in the way of doing a big stunt. Right. Come on. Oh, there's still a car on that side. I have to go around. Will I make it? Won't I make it? Not gonna what? No! Ah, here! Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Line it up. Whoa! Ah, boo! Come on! Give me a big... Big roll or something. Oh, damn. Here, we'll try it one more time. Come on. Give me a gap. I have a gap. Whoa, ah, no traffic to crash into. Oh, 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 well that was, that was pretty cool looking. <laughs> okay. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. Let me know in the comments. Are you looking forward to the new movie? I am. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe if you want to. I just recently passed 500 subs, which means soon I'll be able to do community posts. That unlocks at 500, but they usually give it to you a week or two after that happens. Anyway, until the next time, this is Death Star Killer, signing off.